Users can access the test run view by clicking on any older test runs in the project's view. This view presents test run execution information, execution time, the executed devices, as well as a summary of the test run. Here it shows a summary of the test run, including basic test run information, downloadable files, and success ratio of tests and devices. Device statuses. On the top right of the test, you can filter devices based on the device state. You can click on the info icon on the device line to see more specific errors. You can also retry the test run for a single device by clicking on the retry button. Keep in mind, the previous test run information for that device will be overwritten. Now let's check one of the devices. Click one device. In this view, you'll get more device level information of the test. You can use the device session browser to switch and check the devices. Control panel. This panel gives you important data and summary about how the test run, device behavior, and how the selected device performed with respect to other devices in this run. Tests and steps. If your test contains test steps or test functions, they are presented here in order of execution and whether the functions executed successfully or not. Issues. After the test execution, we run some statistics against the devices in the test run. This allows us to highlight some execution issues in this tab that we believe are interesting to you. Output files. All generated and captured files from the test execution can be found here. Screenshots and video files are visible in Next Widget, while log files are also viewable here below with search and highlight support. To download any created files, click on the icon. Media Widget. The screenshots and test video recording view shows all captured screenshots during the selected test. Screenshots are presented in the order of capturing. The log view provides line-by-line -line information about the test run. It allows showing the different types of log data available from the test run. The performance widget provides details of the test run for CPU and memory usage. By clicking on any given step, time, you can get more specific information about resource consumption.